All right, let's check out shares of Tesla trading. Just about level, but down a pinch today on some rather big news. Big in terms of size, anyway. The EV maker will unveil its 18-wheeler semi at a factory in Nevada tonight, and PepsiCo will receive the first delivery of Tesla semis tonight. This all comes after a three year delay. Yahoo Finance's senior autos reporter, Proud Supermanian, joins us with the details. What do we know about this big boy? You know, it'll be the first time seeing it, the production version in the flesh here, this 18-wheeler uh, semi-truck, as they call it. Uh, it should possibly, um, we're hearing that it'll have around 500 miles of range, which is very impressive, towing 80,000 pounds, which is the max weight that a Class 8, I guess, vehicle can tow. So, very impressive stats. We'll get the official, hopefully get the official numbers later tonight when at the reveal event in Giga, Nevada. Uh, and they said PepsiCo will be the first uh, recipient of these trucks. They're going to use them in their frito Lake facility in Modesto. So they're going to be kind of rejiggering that facility to, to kind of deal with electric trucks and those big kind of semis as well. So uh, a big night for Tesla here. But I think there's some concern or some kind of, you know, skepticism if this thing can actually do that for the right price. Yeah, <laughs> let alone if the question. power grid can support them. Yeah, yeah. then that's yeah. another big factor in all this. Uh, Press, there was also a couple of headlines crossing today just in terms of Tesla adjusting their prices on a couple of models in an effort to boost demand. Why are they doing this now? Yeah, I mean, it, it looks concerning on the face of right? cutting prices. Electric reporting that they're sending out dealer notices to cut the Model Y Model 3 price by 3500 bucks each in the month of December to kind of boost deliveries in this month because of the fact that they're concerned or they're seeing people canceling orders because they want to get that IRA uh, tax credit that starts again for, for Tesla in January. So they're saying, hey, we'll give you half that credit now if you get this truck now or get this car now. So that's the kind of the reason behind it because they don't have a backlog of cars sitting on their lots in December uh, when their numbers come out for Q4 deliveries. They want to get those cars out the door and restart it again in January uh, for Q1. And I think the semi has a $40,000 Tax yeah. break, yeah. Uh, so that's a Which big is a one. huge, big huge incentive, incentive there. Huge, and that's yeah. why we saw Elon Musk say, "Hey, we got that that truck coming soon, December first. You know, We're, that right. came out of nowhere." So, uh, all right, we'll see. I don't know. I guess it'll be entertaining. It but always is. Unveils are always it entertaining. Always so we'll we'll see. Real quick, there might be a surprise. So we'll see. There's there's. What do you a, think that will be? I might might hear some news about the new that Tesla Roadster, that supercar that they had they had teased a while ago. Oh. We'll see. Good we'll tease, see. brother. Oh, okay, Good tease. we'll see what we hear. All right, Pras, thanks so much for having on set.